Wyoming is hosting Arizona State. And currently, currently, the market has it Arizona State minus six and a half, total of 48 and a half on this one. Okay. I like Kenny Dillingham a lot. Uh, his OC is Marcus Arroyo, who was at UNLV. Jay Sawville was the defensive coordinator at Wyoming. He takes over as the, op- or not the offensive coordinator, he takes over as the head coach. He is still going to be involved somewhat with the defense. Aaron Bowl, who is Craig Bowl's son, is going to be taking over as DC. Wyoming was able to handle UNLV almost with no issue when Marcus Arroyo was at UNLV. They got that offense down. They knew what they were doing. Is Wyoming the most talented team in the country? Absolutely not. Arizona State, somehow, somehow, some way, you look at that 247 talent composite, and they are number 30 in the talent composite. Wyoming is number 122. But Wyoming has a bunch of dudes that fit into a system that Jay Sawville is going to continue to run at Wyoming. My number on this is actually Arizona State minus 1.6. So way off the market here. And I was able to find a Wyoming plus 7.5 because I I think it's going to keep steaming the opposite direction. I think that people think Arizona State is going to handle this. And it reminds me so much of Texas State, not Texas State, Texas Tech going to Wyoming to start last year. And they had way more talent. And they seemed to be the way better team. And they were a Big 12 dark horse and blah, 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 blah. And Wyoming was able to handle them because they've got a system, because they believed. And it is an absolute home field advantage for Wyoming in Laramie. So give me Wyoming plus the seven and a half. I feel good about it. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. 